nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Throughout history, humans have been deeply intrigued by the mysteries of outer space, a curiosity that has driven us to explore the cosmos. As our understanding of space has grown, so too has our ability to reach the stars, thanks to advancements in rocket technology. However, this progress comes at a cost, one that impacts our own planet in irreversible ways. Rockets, while enabling us to venture into space, also generate a substantial environmental toll. They spew forth vast quantities of emissions, including soot, and litter Earth's orbit with space debris. The toll on our environment from these space escapades is undeniably high. Elon Musk's SpaceX has seized the spotlight with its pioneering technology and achievements in space missions that were once thought impossible. Yet, it is important to recognize that SpaceX's triumphs, like those of other space programs, leave behind a formidable carbon footprint. Elon Musk has gained recognition for his distinctive approach to addressing environmental issues. His enterprises, such as Tesla and SolarCity, have revolutionized the electric vehicle and solar power industries, emphasizing sustainability and environmental consciousness. Musk's commitment to environmental responsibility extends not only to the conceptual aspects of his businesses, but also to the operations within his factories. One notable example is the Gigafactory 5 in Texas, an immense facility the size of 100 football fields, which places sustainability at its core by harnessing eco-friendly solar panels for power. A report from Tesla's official website reveals that the adoption of Tesla's electric vehicles by customers has averted roughly 5 million metric tons of CO2 emissions. To put this into perspective, a coal-powered plant emits approximately 3.6 million metric tons of CO2 emissions in a year. Elon Musk's dedication to incorporating renewable, reusable, and natural resources into his vast manufacturing operations aligns with his commitment to delivering products that adhere to these same principles. Nevertheless, a fundamental question arises. Why does Elon Musk, who displays such a strong commitment to environmental protection and climate action, invest so extensively in rocket development? To address this question, it is necessary to explore the ecological implications of space travel missions. Space travel has an undeniable destructive impact on the environment. The sight of rockets launching into space is awe-inspiring, but it conceals a significant carbon footprint left in their wake. Consider a massive balloon, with a diameter equal to that of a football field, capable of holding approximately one ton of CO2 when fully inflated. A traditional rocket can fill this balloon roughly 300 times in just 18 seconds of flight. The environmental consequences of space travel largely hinge on the type of fuel used by these spacecraft. Traditional rocket fuel emits substantial amounts of carbon dioxide, contributing to atmospheric warming and global climate change. However, with advancements in technology, some New Age companies have begun to employ cleaner fuels that release significantly less carbon dioxide into the atmosphere. The pivotal question then becomes, how does SpaceX fare in comparison to traditional rockets in terms of environmental impact? SpaceX made its debut in the orbital launch arena in 2005 with the Falcon 1, a privately funded project that cost approximately $100 million in development. Three years later, in 2008, the Falcon 1 achieved its first successful launch. SpaceX's ambitions soared higher with the development of the Falcon 9, a larger orbital rocket that marked a pivotal shift in the company's focus towards making space travel more accessible and sustainable. The Falcon 9 went on to become the world's first orbital-class reusable rocket, a breakthrough that significantly lowered costs. Nonetheless, as SpaceX achieved success, concerns mounted about its environmental footprint. In 2018, SpaceX unveiled the Falcon Heavy rocket, the most powerful rocket since the Saturn V from the Apollo missions. The launch of this colossal spacecraft was witnessed by millions worldwide, drawing attention for its affordability and reusability. Yet, critics pointed out its considerable carbon emissions due to its use of refined petroleum and liquid oxygen as fuel, compounded by its massive size. Another pressing issue is space debris, with approximately 150 million objects already in space, posing a risk of collision. 
SpaceX's missions to Mars raise concerns about further pollution on another celestial body, potentially replicating the environmental issues we've encountered on Earth. This is where the Starship comes into play. The Starship, along with the Super Heavy Booster, represents a fully reusable space travel system that will be the most powerful launch vehicle ever constructed, capable of carrying over 100 tons of payload. Crucially, it aims to leave no pollutants in outer space, offering a potential solution to the space debris problem. The Starship is presently under development at the Starbase, a private testing site and rocket production facility situated in Brownsville. Although initially intended for Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy launches, Elon Musk has redirected its purpose exclusively towards Starship development. In a short span, the site has expanded significantly, acquiring essential test capacity and rocket production capabilities. Musk has also hinted at plans to launch astronauts from this site in the future. However, not everyone is pleased with SpaceX's current program. Environmental activists raise concerns about increased launches leading to more emissions and noise pollution. Some have even alleged unauthorized test flights, with the debris from failed launches taking nearly three months to clean up. Yet, does this mean SpaceX's ambitious plans are inherently detrimental to the environment? Not necessarily. The Starship's Raptor engines, which run on liquid oxygen and liquid methane, offer hope. While these engines do emit carbon dioxide and water vapor, SpaceX envisions recycling emitted CO2 into fuel, potentially making Starship launches environmentally friendly. From a theoretical standpoint, Starship launches have the potential to be eco-friendly. They involve a reusable launch vehicle, and SpaceX may be able to gather fuel from Mars on return trips by converting Martian CO2 and hydrogen into methane and water. In essence, Starship is poised to become the first ever carbon neutral rocket. SpaceX also intends to use its carbon neutral Starship to replace traditional jet aircraft with Earth to Earth rocket flights. This promises significantly reduced travel times between continents and a simultaneous reduction in our environmental footprint. In summary, SpaceX's commitment to developing reusable rockets represents a significant positive step forward. Reusing large-scale spacecraft has the potential to reduce both costs and pollution associated with space travel. When compared to other options, SpaceX emerges as a clear leader. Although achieving truly eco-friendly space travel is a complex endeavor, SpaceX is actively pursuing this goal. What are your thoughts on this matter? Is SpaceX detrimental to the environment, or does its emphasis on sustainability and innovation outweigh the drawbacks? We invite you to share your perspectives in the comments below. If you found this video informative, please consider liking and subscribing to Tech World. Thank you for your attention and we look forward to our next video encounter.